2 over 7 plus 1 half. We can't add fractions with different denominators. Before we can add them, we must make the denominators the same. So, we need to find the least common denominator of these fractions. The least common denominator is the least common multiple, LCM, of the denominators. The denominators are 7 and 2. Find the least common multiple of 7 and 2. The multiples of 7 are 7, 14, and so on. The multiples of 2 are 2, 4, 6, and so on. Find the smallest number that appears in both lists. The least common multiple of 7 and 2 is 14. The least common denominator equals the least common multiple, which equals to 14. Use the least common denominator to write equivalent fractions with like denominators. Remember, in order to find the equivalent fraction, you need to multiply both parts, the numerator and the denominator, by the same number. The equivalent fraction of 2 sevenths is 4 over 14. The equivalent fraction of 1 half is 7 over 14. Then add 4 fourteenths and 7 fourteenths. Add the numerators and keep the denominator the same. The answer is 11 fourteenths. Subtraction. 5 sixths minus 2 ninths. We can't subtract fractions with different denominators. Before we can subtract them, we must make sure the denominators are the same. So we need to find the least common denominator of these fractions. The least common denominator is the least common multiple, LCM, of the denominators. The denominators are 6 and 9. Find the least common multiple of 6 and 9. The multiples of 6 are 6, 12, and so on. The multiples of 9 are 9, 18, and so on. Find the smallest number that appears in both lists. The least common multiple of 6 and 9 is 18. The least common denominator is equal to the least common multiple, which is equal to 18. Use the least common denominator to write equivalent fractions with like denominators. Remember, in order to find the equivalent fraction, you need to multiply both parts, the numerator and the denominator, by the same number. The equivalent fraction of 5 sixths is 15 over 18. The equivalent fraction of 2 ninths is 4 over 18. Then subtract 4 over 18 from 15 over 18. Subtract the numerators and keep the denominator the same. The answer is 11 over 18. If this video was helpful, please leave a like. For more videos like this, please subscribe.